Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be reviewing Life by Thix. Um, Thix makes a lot of great apps. Um, Beaker, which I've done before, Chemist, and um, Micro will be coming out soon. I've also done Space. So they make a lot of cool science apps. Most of them cost money, but they do th cool things quite often. So in this video, we're going to be reviewing Life, which explores the human body, but it's not just another um, human body anatomy app. So this app isn't like other anatomy apps in the way that you can actually simulate um, various things like if someone has a disease, um, if someone just ate chocolate, if they're running, you can see how that affects the body currently, their heart rate, um, the oxygen levels, etc. So let's check it out. So here it is. Here's the human body's organs, some of them at least, um, lungs, brain, intestines, and various things. Tapping on each one um, shows different information, so that's just some basic navigation. Um, but this in the top left is shows the heart rate, blood pressure, oxygen saturation, respiratory rate, and the body temperature. So tapping on each thing tells you more information. Um, has a lot of information, very complex. Let's tap on the brain, for example. You can tap on some of these things to see what it's doing. Electro receptors, secretion. So that's information about the brain. Getting out of that, we go to the top right corner and you can see current symptoms of the body. Bradycardia means resting heart rate of under 60 beats per minute. And of course there's hypokalemia and we're back in the sinus rhythm. And now we're back out. But anyway, that's the conditions in the top right. And going to the bottom left, we have blood work. There's a lot of information. This will be good for students, not just, not kids, but actual students experimenting, um, learning about the human body. This three lines is a button that um, you can restart the app, um, turn sound off, language. Um, and there's a constant filter. Um, it gets rid of recreational drugs, alcohol, and tobacco, and sex organs um, if you're under the age of 18, so that's a good feature. But I think it can be bypassed pretty easy, but there's terms and conditions, and here is a disclaimer that's a mile long. Um, in the bottom right, you have physiology, psychology, and pathology. These are the things I was talking about earlier, which you can turn on to affect the human body. For example, bleeding, allergy, infect, inflame, vertigo, pain. That's some pathologies that can affect the body. And you can examine what happens when you turn those on. Um, psychology, you can add fright, stress, depressed, anxiety. Physiology, you can have them run, apnea, cold, make them hot, urinate, defecate, sleep, and relax. So various conditions you can put them in there. This button, um, you can do emergency things like CPR, tracheal, intubation, and defibrillation. You can do ectomies too, so you can see what will happen to the body, see how it um, reacts. You can tap on this one, and you can put drugs in like um, that you get at the hospital, fluids. So there's drugs, hormones, food, cells and pathogens so you can add specific ones like e coli um, influenza coronavirus to see what happens to the body so that's a basic overview of the functions and how you navigate this app complex app you can do a lot of things but let's actually have it do some specific things let's like make them run see how that affects their heart rate so right now it's 69 and this app does have sounds you can hear them breathing you can hear the various other things in the body making noises. So the heart rate really hasn't gone up, but maybe it will. The body temperature is, the RPM is the same. Um, let's add some other things. Let's add fright. Maybe they're running from something, but it looks like you, can have, you can't have two at once, so we'll just leave it at run. Um, we'll have them eat some candy, see how that makes them. So they just orally ate some chocolate. And you can see uh, the pH of the stomach and various other things there. Their RPM is going up from the constant running. Let's add some energy drinks, see what happens with that. So RPM is 27. Um, the heart rate is 74. 
the heart rate is slowly going up. Our PM has gone up quite a bit since we started all the conditions. Body temperature t- has also gone up also. So you can see that you can experiment and see what happens with each body function. You can go deeper um, into each lung and see how it's performing. When you're running, the lung is going to be working harder and faster. Obviously, drinking energy drink and chocolate isn't probably going to help in your performance. But let's set it back to normal and see, see the body slow down. Things are slowly um, going down. RPM, temperature... So anyway, you can see how things are affected by the various things you can do with physiology. Um, obviously, you can do psychology and pathology. No need to try all of those. Um, let's try something emergency just to show it. Let's try CPR, and you have to tap. And right now, I'm messing the body up. I put the body in tachycardia. Have you say that? Um, is a heart rate that exceeds the normal resting rate. So yeah, 260 beats per minute. It's probably a little too much, but anyway, you can see the various things you can do with this app. Um, you can see how various things affect the body's functions. Um, it's not necessarily an anatomy app, which some might think. This is an app to see how the various organs react to you, um, giving it various medicines, food, um, and various physical and psychological activities. So this is a very cool app um, for those really interested in health and um, medical things. Um, This isn't for me exactly, but some of you will enjoy this app, especially since everybody's learning from home, or quite a bit are. So for those medical students or those possibly interested in the future, you might really get a kick out of this. So this does cost money, but at the end of the day, what's it going to cost your lunch for one day? So Anyway, I hope you guys like this video. Let me know what you think of the app. Um, if you like this video, please leave a like. Comment down below um, what other app reviews I should make or what other videos I should make. And please subscribe if you thought this video was helpful and you like my content. Thank you guys so much and have a good rest of your day. Goodbye.